A Council Bluffs mother wants answers and action after she says her seven year old did not show up for an after school program and nobody seemed to notice. It is not the first time this has happened. Reporter Shantae Passmore is live at the News Center with this story, new at six. Shantae. I spoke to the concerned mother today who didn't want to be on camera, but wanted to share her story in hopes of promoting child safety and accountability. It's a parent's worst nightmare, not being able to find your child. For a mother in Council Bluffs, it becomes reality twice, while her son was supposed to be at an after-school program. To make it worse, she tells us no one at Rue Elementary School in Council Bluffs noticed he was missing. All she could assure me is, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry, I don't know who took attendance. Both times, the student managed to walk off the school property while no one was watching to his grandma's house about a mile away. The reoccurring issue was brought to school officials' attention thanks to the mother's Facebook post going viral. We share her concern about the safety of her child and everyone in the program, no doubt about it. So what we need to do as a school district is to continue to look at our attendance procedures to make sure that even if we know a child isn't there, we find out why. The school features two after school programs, one run by the district, the other by its education foundation. The mother alleges both operations are poorly managed and claims both programs don't have an emergency strategy in place. The school district disagrees. All the students in the school practice and are aware of the various drills, including lockout, lockdown, severe weather, tornado, or intruder drills. The upset parent says her husband wants to pull their children out of the after-school program, but they want to continue going to it. All she wants, she says, is for her children to be safe and cared for when she's not around. A spokesperson for the Council Bluffs Community School District told me, starting tomorrow, unrelated to these incidents, the after-school programs will require students to have a badge, which allows them to verify their attendance. Live in the studio, Shante Passmore, KMTV Action 3 News.